In this video, we'll discuss about brachial plexus injury, herbs and clunkish palsy, and easy ways to remember them. In brachial plexus injury, herbs palsy is due to injury to the upper root that is C5 and C6 and clumkis palsy is due to injury to the lower root that is C8 and T1. To remember them, you can use the alphabetical order. In alphabetical order, E is upper letter and K is the lower letter. Similarly, herbs palsy is the upper palsy and clumkis palsy is the lower palsy. To remember the deformity in herbs palsy, when you rotate E from the herbs palsy in the anti-clockwise direction, it will form W. That is, herbs equals to waiter's tip deformity. You can see the deformity in this picture. And this deformity is due to the paralysis of the abductors and the external rotators. For the deformity as seen in Clumkis palsy, you can use K as a mnemonic where K stands for claw, claw hand deformity and also for the Clumkis palsy. You can see the deformity in this picture and this deformity is due to the paralysis of the intrinsic muscles of the hand. Also note, as Clumkis palsy is the lower palsy, it can involve T1 leading to the Harner syndrome. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more videos.